Good morning, fam. Good morning, fam. And Juma Mubarak to the Islam people out here. And um, I wish you assalamu alaikum. You know, to the world. Out there to the world, fam. As I sip of my tea. Thank God it's Friday, fam. Thank God it's Friday. Well, anyway, it's a short one before I hit the plantation. It's going to be about Kanye again. Kanye again. As I um, analyze what's been happening this um, past week with Kanye, I think he's a goddamn genius. I think he's a genius, fam. You might say, why you say this here? Check it out, fam. This dude, he was with Adidas and all his other companies, and somehow they was holding him back. No, those was his um his shoes, his products, but um they had the power. They had the power. And I was watching um a little clip of Dame Dash. He said when um Kanye came from Paris and he got the deal with um I think it was a Gap. He was like, he said you not if you're not sitting on the board, you're not gonna be happy. That's what he told him. Dame's a smart brother. You know what I'm saying? He told Kanye that, but Kanye's like, get my foot in the door, I'm gonna make it, right? So now it gets to a point where he was worth eleven billion dollars, right? So he feels that um shit, I can get more money. If I got 11 billion right now, I can probably get more money, right? People are trying to say um Kanye is a, a nutcase. Um, if you right now, you look at the internet, there's a lot of black people out there like, ah, no, they, they're really um, laughing on the down low about what his situation now, right? But um, remember when he bought think, about 200,000 acres, some shit, a, a lot of land out there in Wisconsin, some goddamn place like that there? A lot of land, right? He's worth so much money now. You know what I'm saying? He don't need Adidas. He don't need Balenciaga. So everyone, oh, they left him. So to what? These are sl y'all slave-minded people there who feel that um, y'all need um, a big name behind you. You know what I'm saying? You can't go independent. You know, like the little, like little rappers nowadays, but on a, this is a larger scale now. He don't need no Adidas and Balenciaga. This man got millions and millions of dollars. He has all that land out there. Then how much goddamn warehouse he can build out there? You know what I'm saying? And just make his own Yeezys itself? Hire some brothers out there? Come on, man. This is a big come up. Y'all not seeing. Y'all not seeing the bigger picture. Y'all see the bigger picture. Now he's free. You saw the interview when he said um, uh, something about, I am Adidas. They can't drop me. If he didn't want to get dropped, why would he say that, fam? Huh? Use your heads. That's what he said. You know what I'm saying? I am Adidas. They cannot drop me. <laughs> he wanted to get dropped. He needed his freedom now. You know what I'm saying? His um, sorry ass woman there, she gone. You know what I'm saying? So now he's free. You know what I'm saying? This is a good thing for Kanye, I say. He said, be always behind these um, companies who don't, I see him. These companies don't give a goddamn about black people. All the stuff that you're with, all this Louis Vuitton and all this other fancy shit there, nothing in there. How many black people sit on their boards or something? How many black designs do they have? You know what I'm saying? Which I always sit out there and give their money back, you know? Just like the Christmas season coming up now. Now you idiots out there buying every goddamn thing. I get the PlayStation. I got to get this. I got to get the wife here, new fur jack. I get all this goddamn shit there. All you do is make people rich. You know what I'm saying? Kanye trying to enlighten you fools. You know what I'm saying? People been trying to enlighten you fools, but y'all don't care. It's all about materialistic things. You know what I'm saying? What I got, look what I got. You know what I'm saying? I really get sick of seeing that shit there, right? We know people who really don't, don't have it like that. They just barely make it like that. You know what I'm saying? They might show them, what, you know, a nice coat on or this and that there. But you see these people here, if they're not living in the houses and things like that, they still live in like apartments in the hoods and stuff like that, whatever shit like that there. You know, it's fake. It's really fake. But Kanye is free now. You know, he's a free Negro now. You know what I'm saying? The other ones, y'all chained up. You see, they scared. They all scared. No one backing them. You know what I'm saying? But when Kanye come around, oh, yeah, 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 this and that, this and that. But ain't no damn well what he's saying. They feel it's correct, but they're scared to say it. A whole bunch of cowards out there. So you got to give Kanye that respect for saying what he, you know, saying what it is. You know what I'm saying? But like I say, now he's free. That probably was a power move with him doing there. Wanting to get dropped from these people. Get free from them. All this money he got, all this goddamn land he got. Adidas, who, 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 who's, who's still rocking Adidas? Tell me. How many Adidas do you see? I got Nike shirt on Air Jordans on my foot right now. You know what I'm saying? Adidas. I haven't rocked Adidas since the shell top joints. Back in like, um, I got a pair of Adidas. Yeah, I was in Georgia, 1986. 
1980s. That was the last pair of, of Adidas that I had. That was back when Run DMC had some of my Adidas, and we all had to have those in the club. You no, know? see, this. we had to represent. But like I said, Kanye is free now. He don't need these people there. But people, these feeble-minded people there, are laughing at him. Oh, he, he lost this. He lost that. He lost this here. Oh, he lost two billion dollars in one day. Oh, there they smile, laughing. He lost two billion dollars within a couple of hours. These people out here, they'll probably make about in their whole goddamn lifetime, not even a million dollars in their whole life. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? In their whole life, working hard, whole nine to five. But they want to sit here and talk some smack about Kanye. Kanye is free now. I predict this here. I do predict this here. That he's going to um, have the last laugh. Kanye will have the last laugh. I'm saying he's going to have the last laugh. Why? Because he needs nobody. You got men like that. Man, he got 11 million right now. But shit. If he got, he could make $11 million or gap with other people like that there. He get his shoes out there, get some distributors, you know, get some distributors, call up Russell Simmons, you know, talk to some people he might know or whatever, find some other people there that's going to sell your stuff there. You know what I'm saying? We well, need to see the bigger picture, but I tell people like this here, you know what I'm saying? People always looking at America. They need America to do things there, right? To buy your wear clothes, whatever they're your products for you to succeed, Right? Why not go to the African market where one country is bigger than the, he has more population, let's say like Nigeria, than all America. What about if he got just got that Nigerian on spot there and just bow and, and it and just flourished here? Made him affordable for the African bros to rock. You know what I'm saying? Some nice stuff there just for them, you know? Come on, man. These y'all, I'm saying y'all, <laughs> feeble minded people, always you no, know, always in the box. You know, always in the box. You gotta learn to make your own damn company. You gotta learn how to do that there. And not just be your, your companies in America saying like this. Think abroad too. Well, think abroad. You know, like the passport bros. That's what we do. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what we do. When people sit there and talk about the passport bros, I sit there and laugh at them. Not knowing what we we trying, what we trying to achieve, you know what I'm saying? Making businesses in other goddamn countries. You know what I'm saying? But we we don't talk about that so much. They just talk about um dudes going here to find poor women to have sex. You stupid idiots. Like I said, y'all have no passports. Y'all need to shut up. You know what I'm saying? But back to Kanye, fam. You know what I'm saying? He's free now. He's free. He's running free now. I'm saying it's in his brain now. I, I can see it. He's laughing now. You know what I'm saying? He's laughing. He's going to come back again. All these people there, they, um, how you saying? Just let him go. Like, forget Kanye. This and that. This and that. There. Watch. Watch. They're going to bite their words. They're going to come back to Yeezy. They don't come back to yay, you know, looking on, <laughs> be on this goddamn job, put their hands out and things like that. But he knows, he sees this here, the ones who um didn't back, who did not support him, you know what I'm saying? The ones who hid and ran like little cowards, you know what I'm saying? He sees this here, the cam short sure, fam. Well, anyway, fam, that's my little short one. You have a good day, you know what I'm saying? Have a good Friday, you know what I'm saying? Do not drink and drive, you know what I'm saying? But if you do, hey, it's on you. And I'm my fam. Peace. <laughs>